May Regala's rebellion turn to Only drawn dust. blades can end this rebellion. How's this possible? Aloy, Patience. blood of the ten, Aloy. Regala denied, the truth of the visions revealed. I doubt you have enough skin to mark all your deeds. We'll just have to remember them then. <laughs> well, thanks to you, the chief still lives. And hope remains. But that's not why I wanted to speak with you. I need a favor. A personal one. My grandson, Cabo. He was not counted among the dead. Which means he must still be with Regala's remaining forces. He was taken prisoner? No. He joined them willingly. Like many young soldiers who seek to mark their skin with distinguished deeds. I must search for him. Convince him to come home. Chief Hikaru cannot spare any soldiers for this task, so my blade is alone in this. Unless you'd be willing to join me. I know it is much to ask after all you've done for us. But Kavo is the last of my blood. What made Kavo join Regala's rebellion? For some, Regala represents a chance of vengeance against the Karja. During the Red Raids, it wasn't easy to turn the clans back at Baron Light. Many wanted to pursue the Karja all the way to Meridian. So when Regala attacked the embassy, they took it as a call to arms. Yes. But others, the young especially, <laughs> care only about the glory they think they'll earn by hunting an age-old enemy. As for Cavo, it was probably a bit of both, and a youthful desire for a cause to get the blood burning. Nothing I said could stop him. So if Cavo didn't listen to you when he joined the rebels, what makes you think he will now? Cavo was too young to fight during the Red Raids. More was a stranger to him. But he must have experienced the suffering it brings by now. He will listen. Must. I just have to find him before it's too late. You said Kavo's your last living relative? Yes. Before Chief Ikaro, the clans warred constantly with each other. Every skirmish claimed another comrade. One by one, I buried my children. And then their children. I'm sorry. I tried to vent my grief on the battlefield, but I never found comfort there. Only in the wisdom of the visions. And even so, I still couldn't prevent Cavo from following the trail of blood. If Cavo joined Regala's rebellion of his own accord, will Hikaru let him back into the tribe? The chief knows the value of mercy and the toll of unending bloodshed. It's the rest of the tribe I'm more concerned about. They won't quickly accept someone who betrayed them. Even with my support, it won't be easy. But you have to try. I'll help you find your grandson, if I can. Where do we start? A while back, our scouts reported Cavo's squad left one of Regala's outposts in the hills to the south. His squad never returned, but the scouts also spotted one of our own being held captive there. So we'll start at the outpost. If we free the prisoner, maybe they'll know where Kevo's squad went. Shall we head out? Let's go. Good. This way. The outpost isn't far. These new visions speak all the knots I want. We should look to the defenses. You know, the rebels aren't going to give up without a fight. Then we'll have to give them one. The bloodshed won't end until Regala is defeated. But what matters is the soldier they took captive, Nikala. She's been their prisoner for some time now. She's my only lead to finding Kavo. We'll get her back. And then Kavo too.
The outpost should be just ahead. You take point, I'll follow. That's a rebel outpost. I'll we'll have to find whoever's in charge and take them out. The machine's resistant to fire. Make this easier on the both of us. This will be over soon. Anything to go on? They're down there! Uh, hunt her down! Uh, 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 uh,
That's all of them. Our scouts said they saw Nakala tied up at a wood post. Let's look around. Strange. Planks of wood, with nothing on top of it. What is it? I think there might be something under here. Take my hand, Nicola. Steady now. Where am I? Chaplin? Is that you? And with an outlander. Whoa. How'd you end up down there? <sighs> Rebels had me strung up. They thought I'd give up intel about lowland squad movements by letting me bake in the sun. Managed to slip my bonds and make a run for it. They made me pay for that. Last thing I remember was a crack on the head and the taste of dirt. <sighs> How'd you end up here? We're looking for Cavo. His squad was last spotted leaving this outpost. Yeah, he was here. It was his squad that attacked us on the road. My comrades got away, but I was taken. Cabo tied me to the post himself. If you're looking for him, Chaplain, I'm afraid you'll only find a dead end. His loyalties are clear. Do you know where his squad went? I overheard them mention Fall's Edge. Then we'll... we'll pick the search up from there. I'll go ahead and meet you at Fall's Edge, southwest of here. Decca, if Cavo attacked her squad... No! He's not lost to us yet. We have to find him and turn him from this path. <sighs> okay. I'll see you there. What about you? That wound needs to be looked at. It'll scar. I just need to rest a bit, then I'll report into the grove. I'm telling you, Bloodhair. The chaplain might not want to hear it, but her grandson is a traitor. I guess we'll see about that.
There's Fall's Edge. Deca should be waiting for me in there. I'm telling the truth. Listen to him, Aroke. Not a chance. Deca, what's going on? Aloy, I'm glad you're here. This is Aroke, leader of Fall's Edge. So you've enlisted the Chief's champion in your dull-bladed efforts. You must be Cavo, then. My grandson. And a soldier trying to right his mistakes. Or trying to lure us into a trap. My scouts caught him. Sneaking around on the outskirts of the village. I wasn't sneaking around. I was coming to warn you. The rebels are planning an attack. They're going to send a machine straight through this village. I left my post when I realized what they were planning. You have to believe me. Where are the rebels now? They were hunting for the machine north of here. I, I can show you the way. The only thing you'll do is face trial by combat. You betrayed your clan. Your chief. Blood and blades will decide your fate. I'll fight whoever you want, after we stop the attack. Why destroy this village? I thought Regala's fight was with Hikaro. Hikaro was a lowlander before he was chief. Unlike the Desert and Sky clans, we stand behind him without question. Fall's Edge is a strategic midpoint between the Grove and our capital on the coast. It's true. Our orders were to cut off Hikaro's support from the Lowland clan. But I thought that meant disrupting supply routes, not slaughtering an entire village. You said you defected after you found out about the attack. Why'd you change your mind? When I joined the rebels, I thought Regala was going to lead us into battle against our old enemy, the Karja. But all we've done is kill each other. And for what? Pride? Vengeance? So when my squad leader told us about the mission to destroy this village, I left my post. Don't believe his lies. Anyone who deserted the tribe to join Regala knew exactly what they were getting themselves into. Not everyone. If Cavo is telling the truth, this whole village is in danger. We have to find and stop these rebels. The rebels built a campfire north of the river, near the cliffs. I can show you the way from there. Okay. Open it up, or okay? No. I won't give him the chance to escape. The traitor stays here until his trial by combat. Then I invoke blood for blood. I will take Kavo's place until he returns. You're making a mistake, Chaplain. The clan needs your guidance, not the lies of this bare-armed boy. The right has been called. Cavo will go with Aloy. Then I'm going to. If the boy speaks truth, you'll need my blade. If he lies, I'll run him through. I must make arrangements here first. Then I'll bring the boy to the meeting place. Fine. I'll see you there. Was there something else?
I should go. See you at the campfire. The campfire that Cavo mentioned should be nearby. What's taking so long? They should be here already. Someone's waiting ahead. But not Cav... Rebels. Friends of Cavo's? Gonna have to take them out to get to that campfire. Clear. Movement. Air. Did this. This could be a diversion. We should go back to our posts. Whoever showed up, Cavo has some explaining to do. Better wait at the campfire for him and Loki. Okay. Found a few of your friends when I got here, Cavo. You're not off to a great start. They must have been out on patrol. I swear on the ten, I didn't know they'd be here. What did I tell you? His lies are an open sore. Better we cauterize it now than let it fester. No! I'm telling the truth! Untie him. As you say. But this is a mistake. And my weapon? If you think... Just give it to him, or okay? We need to get moving. Lead the way.
Up this way. Where are you leading us? The rebels are stationed at the nearby cliff falls. I took this path when I left my post. The others won't be expecting anyone to come this way. Or they are, and will be skewered the moment we arrive. There's the cliff falls. And there's no one there, as I suspected. Let's just keep going. I don't like this. everyone. No rebels, no machine. What did I say? Over there, by the falls. Cut off that tent. If that thing runs through the falls edge, the village stands no chance. Then we stop. Right here. On your lead, Aloy. Nothing will stand Get in our way down. now! Search! Grab your gear. We march on falls edge. should detonate.
Fall's Edge isn't safe until we deal with the Rebels. Keep the pre Cavo, you're bleeding. I'll be fine. What matters is the attack was stopped. Because of your warning, you saved many lives today. Come on, let's get you back to Falls Edge. I guess I cracked some ribs, too. Go on ahead. 
I'll see him back to the village. Okay. I'll let Dekka know what happened. I should dismount. Honor and strength. Your blade is to be rest. You can rest your fern. Walk tall. Nice choice of armor. The trains of the visions were revealed by this outlander. But without three leave, only you return? What happened? Cavo was telling the truth. The rebels had a behemoth. Cavo was injured in the battle, but we stopped the attack. Aroke... Regrets that he doubted the boy. Your grandson proved himself to be honest and brave, Chaplain. He's loyal to the Lowland. So you'll release him? He's earned his freedom. But it'll take many more deeds to earn back the rest of the clan's trust. I'll do whatever it takes. Thank you, Aloy. Indeed. Ball's Edge owes you a great debt. May this begin to repay it. Thank you. As soon as you're healed, I have so much to show you. Welcome back, Cavo. 